My name is Deborah Kaplan, and I am a licensed therapist, author, and speaker. I work with issues of attachment, trauma, sex addiction, and within that expertise, I also work with sex, money, and power. But when we're talking about sex, anger, and eroticized rage, what we're really addressing is the fusing of shame, fear, and anger as it has become sexualized in a way that is not acceptable to the individual, him or herself, and the ways in which it is played out in a detrimental fashion. Sex and shame often go hand in hand. The messages we learn in our families of origin, the messages we have about ourselves and our sexuality can influence in a negative fashion how we play out our very natural, healthy sexual expression. When we are bringing together our own shame, the fear that we may have around that, or anger that is displaced and expressed sexually, the uh, fusion of those three play off in a, a very personally destructive and distressing manner. When I work with clients, I often have them separate the part of them and the behavior that they do enjoy, the part that is an expression of their healthy sexual being, and separate that from the part that is distressing, unpleasant, and in many ways denigrating to themselves and to their being. Couples often come in and they, they write and, and we talk and they say, we love to have healthy sex and we love that we can do this and be honest with each other and that we could talk about our fantasies and that some of what we do sexually is edgy. But there are times the couples come in and they also say, you know, my partner is doing things that I'm not happy with or I feel like I'm being, in a way, projected upon as if I'm not a part of this experience, as if he or she is playing out some angry internal narrative that I'm just there for as um, not a partner, not, not I'm an involved sexual partner, but I'm a witness to this anger. And what I love to do is help couples restore a balance so that whatever is a part of their arousal template and their sexual dance and expression becomes acceptable to them in the way that they grow into their sexual being, in the way that they grow into a healthy sexual expression. Mm -hmm.